What's up guys? Quick preview of this um, PC version of Quack Lee's Vertical Wizard that he did for the Android boxes. So, all games for this PC build is 4,564. Uh, it's on the 64 gigabyte card instead of Quack Lee's 32. So I had to pack it with some extra games, hope you don't mind. <laughs> um, as far as the storage size, it's on a regular 64 gig SanDisk, so it should burn on most 64 gig cards. And it'll burn 64 gigs, but as you can see, there's a little bit extra room. So you can add a few more things if you want anything I might have missed. But uh, not too much of the big games. I tried to get a couple of the big games, but I was like, eh, I'll leave them also as extra room for you guys. So, and I did um, update Quark's theme a little bit. So basically, um, since he used the Hursty vertical theme, a uh, couple, like, all games favorites and, like, MAME were, like, all a certain size, all full width, so I just uh, went in and updated the theme marquees for everything else, so here we go. So, got some more Thomas Wave than Quack had, and um, like Dolphin Blue, that's one of my favorite games on the Thomas Wave, so I got that on there. All these run good. ColecoVision, Final Burn Neo, Mame. Neo Geo, Nintendo, PC Engine, PC Engine CD-ROM, got some Sega CD games on here too, um, they run pretty good, and oh, Star Wars Chess, awesome chess game for all you Star Wars fans, <clears throat> Dreamcast, Master System, Genesis, oh you see there's a little bit of screen tear in the menus, but that's all that's the only place it looks like it is. Uh, Sega Noom, I did add some more Naomi games. I think from what Quack had. So there's some in here. I tested most of them. They all run. The ones that didn't run, I kind of took them off the list. So if there's any more else, my bad. <clears throat> SG-1000, Satellaview. Also threw some Super Nintendo games in here too. That I knew would look kind of good on vertical. So yeah, F-Zero. That looks pretty cool in full screen. <laughs> <clears throat> and, you know, Dr. Mario. Mario Paint. <laughs> for a little fun. <clears throat> Super graphics. And back to all games. So, a couple things I did. Uh, game settings. Aspect ratio for all the systems is full. So it'll take up basically... The full height and width of a vertical screen. I set in system settings as far as the screen rotation. 270 degrees is basically if you turn the screen to the right. Because you can see the bottom of the, of the monitor is on the left side. So I turn the screen to the right. So that's 270 degrees. Um, as far as other game settings. That's about all I really changed. Oh, I turned smooth. Games also you get more of that pixelization feel. Um, <clears throat> did add another vertical theme that has most of the consoles in it. Also, I can just show that real quick. So yeah, this is the other vertical theme I got. So pretty similar um, as far as inside list on top. Image and video on the bottom. <clears throat> but I do love Quark's updated vertical arcade theme though. So I'm going to stick with that. <clears throat> and let's see. So like quick example. Here I go to the favorites because I know. <clears throat> oh yeah, I also got. Um, I noticed some of the main games didn't have the... Um, game samples so I found my samples from my image and I threw them on there so now like Donkey Kong here you'll see hopefully it'll play because it sounds kind of low
Hopefully you guys can hear that. So he's walking. He's jumping. And so yeah, everything seems to be working for those sounds. <clears throat> Before I die. <laughs> so yeah, and uh, Miss Pac-Man, one of my favorite arcade games. Obviously looks awesome on the full vertical screen. Ooh, it's blue to start. So yeah, sometimes it starts blue, but then when you die, it comes back, it goes back to pink, so. But yeah, so, it's a quick little preview of Miss Pac-Man. Doo, doo, doo. All right. Um, let's see. So as far as a non-vertical game, let's see. A Nintendo, yeah, so plenty of those in here. So yeah. Let's see. Adventure Island, just something simple. So yeah, like I said, everything is full full vertical, full width right now. On my next update, I'll probably go in and kind of um, fix some of the horizontal ones so they look a little better. Because um, you can do it a little bit better. Like I think I got, I was testing with one. Let's see. It's still set for, I was testing. Yeah, so, testing, this is a, eight by seven ratio so obviously they got some black bars but keeps the aspect ratio so this is aspect ratio that matches four by three and i'll just quickly go in and change things up a little bit and show you the full vertical look that setting will take so yeah there it is full full screen so yeah still not too bad obviously a little stretched but you know <clears throat> so yeah there's a quick difference of that uh, let's see oh yeah I wanted to show you <laughs> See a Naomi. Oh wait, no. We do a Thomas Wave. I'll show you Dolphin Blue because that's one of my favorites too. See a Dolphin Blue. <clears throat> and yeah, it's running on my little, uh, little teeny IBM Lenovo Think Center down there on the table. So yeah, full screen, full focus screen, looking good. Ouch. <clears throat> so yeah, let's see what else. Oh yeah, F0. Yeah, there we go. This will definitely look stretched, but you know what? I still think it looks good. Because <laughs> it's full screen. <clears throat> Come on, there we go. Oops. Can't do it anymore. Ooh. Oh, crap, I missed the jump. Dang it. Anyway, so yeah, that's the arrow. So yeah. But yeah, so 4,500 games roughly. Got all these systems going. 
Oh yeah, Sega CD, so let me show you. <laughs> Adventures of Willie Beamish. <laughs> That's a fun game too. Yeah, so Batman Returns. Starts off with a nice car chase, so. I think this one loads pretty quick, so. So yeah, you get that. Yay! So yeah, it's pretty good on the full screen too. Quick preview, guys. Probably do a few more tweaks, but yeah. Probably getting ready to upload this and share with the wizards. <laughs>